Today we're solving quadratic equations that are in standard form using the quadratic formula. So the first equation you see here, 2x squared minus 3x minus 5 is equal to 0, is in standard form. And if that's true, this is a pretty simple process. Click on the button that says formulas, look for the quadratic formula, which is here on the right, and notice we have this standard form, ax squared plus bx plus c. You can grab either side. I'm going to grab this one, and I'm going to drag it over here, and notice it's going to change that to the quadratic formula with all my variables in it. I'm going to arrange to pull that back over here, and then the rest of the process is to simplify. So you can click on there to do your um, exponent. You can click there. I'm just simplifying the expression. You do want to leave fractions in your answers. Do not uh, put decimal answers, but fractions are preferred. The square root of 49 is 7. Since you have the plus minus, if you'll double tap on that, it will give you two separate expressions, and then you can simplify each one. You'll get your two solutions. So I have two solutions, five halves and negative one for this first one. All my work is showing. You could drag this up if you want to cover up some of your steps. All right, for this second one, it's not in standard form. To be in standard form, you have your squared term, your x, and your constant on the left side, and it must be equal to zero. So if you see one like this, put it in standard form first, and then you're going to go over to your formula, and you're going to grab this and drag it over, and then it'll plug in the numbers for you. So we're going to simplify this one now. And then we're going to separate these and simplify each one. So this time I have two integer solutions. x is equal to 4 or x is equal to negative 1.